Well, we're on a different section of river today, further downstream from where I usually fish. Although I have been here before, I think last time I was here I caught a nice little chub. Uh, big knock, <laughs> brewing a little fish. The river's a nice, uh, nice colour, it's carrying a fair bit of sediment and it's a nice brown, chocolatey colour. It's up about maybe a foot. Uh, there are six anglers here, so far nobody's had anything. And just as I arrived another chap was leaving, he'd been here since 8 o'clock this morning. And he had caught nothing as well, so it's very, very bright and a lovely warm day for the 7th of October. It really is nice. Uh, so I'll cast in now and uh, it's now 10 past 4 uh, and we'll see what comes of it, hopefully. A nice barbel. Well, there it is. <laughs> it seems alright. It was nice. Not as, bright, not as brightly coloured as the one yesterday, but nevertheless a nice fish. Very nice coloured anal fin. Great big tail. Oh, I think he's about uh, four or five pounds, maybe. Look at those barbules. Yeah, lovely. Yeah, he's got the hiccups. <laughs> it's just after seven o'clock. Yeah, nice olive top. Golden colour. Yeah. So. There we are, a barbell on the bank, <laughs> at long last. Um, so I'll put him straight back in. Well, that was lovely. So I'll just wait for him to recover now. He shouldn't be very long because he hasn't been out very he hasn't been out very long. He's just facing upstream in a slight current. And he's just getting his breath back. Uh, you can see the size of those petrol fins, they're really big.
If you look really closely there, you can see the valve, the very thin, flexible membrane on the end of the gill. Uh, sorry, on the end of the gill cover. When it lowers the roof, sorry, when it lowers the floor of its mouth, that gets pushed tight shut by the water pressure and water is forced in the mouth then when it raises the floor of its mouth the pressure inside the mouth pushes water out backwards pushing this little flap open and there's a flap in the mouth which is pushed closed and that's how basically how the breathing mechanism works I think he quite likes it there. <laughs> He's not very keen on going. Oh, he's thinking about it now. And there he goes. It's now half past seven and it's getting very dark now. So it's time we packed in and we have to be off by nightfall. Uh, we just had that little barbel, feisty little bag of It was a big fight for a little fish. I thought it was going to be bigger than that when it came in. But uh, very, very pleasing. And uh, I hope the takes on the video will say it was getting quite dark then, but the rod ends are up against the uh, a nice blue sky and a uh, nice finish to the evening. So that's three evenings in a row with a nice barbel to round off. Very good after a long session of blanks. So I'll leave it at that and uh, hopefully I'll see you again when we'll have a barbel on the bank. But for now, a very good night to you.